February 26, 2012, exactly one year ago, two strangers met in Sanford, Florida. One died that night, the other's on trial for second degree murder. What happened caused outrage on both sides and led to protests across the country. Trayvon Martin was 17. He was walking home from a convenience store. He was unarmed. George Zimmerman was 29. He was a neighborhood watch captain. He was carrying a gun. We know there was some kind of confrontation between them, and we know that Zimmerman shot and killed Martin. Attorneys for Martin's family say he was racially profiled and shot, quote, in cold blood. Zimmerman said he shot in self-defense after Martin attacked him. When police were called out to the scene, they did not arrest Zimmerman. They said they didn't have enough evidence to disprove his story. As news of the incident spread, people held rallies and protests across the country. Eventually, Zimmerman was arrested and charged with second-degree murder. The cases don't go to trial immediately. His lawyers are building their defense right now as prosecutors plan their legal strategy. The trial, the state of Florida versus George Zimmerman, is scheduled to start in June.